What's up guys, Emily here, and we are back with another video. Now, like I said in my last video, it was a bettering my life video, and it was about me going vegan, um, which so far has been great, like my skin feels amazing. If you can hear things up above, I live in a basement, so anybody who walks up above you're gonna hear. Anyways, so today's video, I thought I would do a makeup thing. I don't want to call it a tutorial because I'm really bad at tutorials, but I have done a few different looks uh, that I have put on my Instagram, so if you would like to see that, the link will be down below. Um, but I wanted to, I haven't done my makeup in like a week, so I wanted to just do my makeup and make a video of it so I'm gonna try to talk through what I'm doing but I'm very bad at doing that uh, so yeah we're just gonna get started actually before we get started uh, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell should be open so you can be notified of when I upload uh, my videos my next videos and yeah now we can get into it so the first thing that I usually like to do um, is to put down a moisturizer because like right now like my skin's you know my skin's okay but uh, it's a little dry so we're just gonna put some moisturizer this kind smells like hand sanitizer but I dig this anyways we're just gonna put this all over my face just like this so bouncy anyways the next thing that I usually start out with is my eyebrows now I've been practicing that's still not uh, perfect um, usually what I use I've had this thing forever it is a uh, let's see Mark Wins International um, eyebrow powder and I have two of them actually actually it's a color word it's eyebrow cake um, I have two of them actually these are like the same things this one's just like a little bit lighter um, but basically I do the shape with this and then I kind of fill it in with like gel and stuff so if I don't talk during this point it's because I am concentrating on my eyebrows because I like to make them look good and usually I just kind of use the mirror from one of my palettes so if I look this way that's because I'm looking at this mirror now the thing is is you know eyebrows are supposed to be sisters not twins um my eyebrows currently are long distance cousins um but you know just gotta keep working at it so i will come back after i you know finish trying to do my eyebrows okay now eyebrows are you know done for now now before you mention anything, uh, I am fully aware that uh, the concealer that I use is just a few shades too dark for my skin. But after I do like foundation and stuff, you can't really tell. So we're moving on. Uh, now what I want to do is before I do like foundation or anything, I usually do my eyes just because of like fallout and stuff. So the first thing I do is primer, obviously. Hello, cat. Um, and what I use is this uh, pretty vulgar um primer and i just take it and i'll put it on my eyelids all right so there we have that now what i'm going to do is choose my colors so i really want to use my remember me palette for colors because i want to do some like bright bright colors so I think I want to go for yellow orange and pink now the thing is is that I always start out with my outer corner which is going to be this hot pink color here called striking 
and this mirror is like so dirty, but we're gonna use that on the outer corner. And I'm basically just buffing it out towards the top and then buffing it out under my eyes as well. All right, so the next color I'm gonna use is this one here called High Key. And that's gonna go on the lid and in the crease in the middle of the eye. I honestly don't know what I'm talking about when I say like crease and stuff like that just because I normally just, you know, put it wherever I want it. But <laughs> that's what we're gonna do. So in the middle and then blending it in with that pink. Now you can't necessarily tell the difference much with it, but if you really look, it's there. Um, anyways, next we're going to use this color here called Sunlit. And it's not going to go completely into the inner corner, but it is going to go most of the way. So, just pack that on my brush. And put it like this. Just so that it's a nice, you know, gradient. And then I'm going to take a little flat brush like this and take each of those colors and go under my eyes with them. Starting from the outer and going in. Just like that. Now I'm going to go ahead and repeat this on the other eye and I'll be right back to do the rest. Now what I want to do is I just kind of want to darken like the outer corner just a little bit. So I'm going to take this uh, purple here called Amethyst and just kind of just with a little bit darken up the outer corner just like that now the thing is is that for some reason I'm pretty sure that my eyes are like not the same because this eye always ends up looking better than this one and like they always look different shape wise but it's fine anyways uh, the next thing we are going to do is foundation and stuff and I'm not going to show that pretty much like on camera so I'm just gonna do like you know foundation powder like things like that so I'm gonna go ahead and do that and I'll be right back all right so now I have all of this done it's not completely like blended in yet but you know I've got that so the next thing I'm gonna do is mascara and lashes. I thought about doing eyeliner today, but like I really just do not have the effort to try and do that. So it's just gonna be mascara and eyelashes. So I am going to use this uh, Marcel Curling and Lengthening Mascara. This is just like a little sample size. And I'm gonna do top and bottom lashes and then and then, <laughs> if I don't drop it, I'm going to do lashes, and then when I come back, I'll figure out what I'm going to do with my lips. But I'm just going to do this, put lashes on, do a few minor touches, and then when we come back, it'll be almost done. Alright, so I have my mascara and my lashes on. Now, if I'm being honest, I still have not properly learned how to correctly put eyelashes on, so they kind of, you know, look a little janky, but... I digress with that as well. Also, <laughs> um, the next thing is lips. Now I haven't decided specifically, but I kind of think I want to go with blue. Now I have two different kinds of blue that I think I kind of want to try and do like a little ombre type thing. So let's see how well this can work. So the ombre didn't work out very well, but I think this kind of goes good together. I think. Anyways, that's just my opinion. Now, the next step, which is normally the last step for me, is highlighter. But I've been obsessed with doing fake freckles. So, I'm going to try to do that real quick. Put some highlighter on, and when I come back, I will show you the finished product. Alright, so after laying my hair down and doing the fake freckles, hopefully they look okay, and doing highlighter, this is the finished product. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. I actually 
kind of dig this look. It's fun and funky and yeah, so if you like it, let me know what, down below in the comments. Also, let me know anything else that you want to see me do. If you have made it this far in the video, thank you. I appreciate you so much. And, you know, without further ado, I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a like, comment, subscribe, all of that fun stuff. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!